for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay with us. We'll have all the action for you live from Madrid here on EA TV. Hello to you, wherever you are. A warm welcome to one of the great football cities, Madrid, and a fine football venue, the Metropolitano. I'm Derek Ray, perched here on the commentary gantry, and sitting alongside me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And with the game just moments away now, this really ought to be a superb watch in Spain against Italy. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Here's the lineup for Spain. Jordi Alba plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. Danny Olmo plays with Ferran Torres out wide. And the main striker today is Morata. Now, just the tackle that was needed. Torres. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Morata makes it count! Varela extremely sloppy in possession Raspadori crossing opportunity he takes aim and no way through Pot. Gabby Carvajal being hounded Possession one Torres Take it away. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Rodri! And they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. Marco Verratti. On to Jorginho. Plenty of support here. Giving it a try. And a decent save. Full credit. And played short. Gives it a go. And foiled by the post. And they can't quite take advantage in the end. Immobile and struggling to get the shot off. Splendid defending. 
Morata. Oh, he's really opened them up here. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. A wild effort it was, and probably the less said about it, the better. Alessandro Bastoni. Marco Verratti. Tremendous intuition to win it back. He's taken on his opponent here. Morata! And a goal! That's his brace! They just can't keep him quiet! Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. So the ball rolling again, 2-0. Giacomo Raspadori. Immobile now. Takes the shot. No problems for the keeper. Great pressure to win the ball back. Opportunity. And there it is. Still life left in this game. And they have the momentum now. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. Well underway again. It's a narrow 2-1 lead as things stand. Morata. Pedri. Now Jordi Alba. Plenty of options. No degree of difficulty at all for the keeper. And snuffing out the danger. Spinazzola. And a penalty awarded, spot kick coming up. And it has been judged to have been a bookable offence. Well, I think the referee's got that right all round. It was a penalty and it was a yellow card. To make it 2-2. And the spot kick is converted as coolly as you like. Here it is again, and he makes it look so easy. He sends the keeper one way before striking it into the opposite side. That's an excellent finish. Well, it has taken a Herculean effort for them to get back to level pegging under these trying circumstances. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. Morata... And you need your defender to take charge. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? Well, it's a long way off target, you've got to say. The well, play was allowed to carry on, but now that it's come to a halt, a caution. Just not looking confident in possession. Well, here's the replay, and he's got to clear his lines there. He doesn't do that. He has his pocket picked, and he's been rightly punished. Poor defending. Three-two it is. Who would have predicted that before a ball was kicked? Oh, 
Spinazzola. It's a perfect challenge. Well, Spain aren't controlling the possession here, but what they've done with it has been really good, and they'll be happy with the way the game is being played. Well, wait a moment, Stuart. Look at what's happening. And having already received a yellow card, he's walking a very fine line. And his race is run. Yeah, he just lost his discipline there. That's a really poor challenge. He should have been taken off much earlier. Throw into Italy. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. Di Lorenzo. Now Immobile. And the keeper showing tremendous command. <laughs> Delivering it. And so it is, the first half of... Away they go again, second half is underway here. Just the challenge that was required. Well, that is how to play advantage. Plenty of support here. Can he take advantage? In it goes! He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him, apparently. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well-balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. Neither side shy about shooting in this match. Rodri. And he read it well, intercepting it. Good pass. A chance to whip it in. Oh, you don't want to lose the ball in that position. Quite simply, an opportunity wasted. Easy for the keeper. Danny Olmo. And that pass could be troublesome. The save was a good one. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, no problems defensively. Jorginho. Barella has it. And a chance to level it. Well, getting in the way. Superb save. Going short. Barella. Well, he has the measure of his opponent. It's there for him. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. <laughs> Trying to pick out a teammate. Not really the ideal clearance. Well, he missed the targets and then some. Wide it went.
30 minutes left for play. Oh, what an opportunity. Is it going to be? Oh, goodness me. He made it far too easy for the keeper, didn't he? Has a go. And the keeper there to deal with it. And short it is. The clearance wasn't decisive. Takes the shot. Not troubling the keeper. Gabby. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Well, going for power and so close to finding the net. Well, it's been a good last 15 minutes for Italy. They're having most of the ball now, and they've created chances. They just haven't had that end product. But you just get a sense that equaliser is coming. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. All hands on deck. Takes it on! A smart stop here. Well, opting for the short corner. Growing pressure here, and another corner. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, the keeper committed himself. Jordi Alba. Carvajal. Determined defending. Just 15 minutes remaining. Velocity. Immobile. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Breaking at pace. Morata. Just made sure nothing came of that. Needs to tread carefully. Cleared away comprehensively. Going well. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. And Italy regaining possession. Leonardo Spinazzola. Who can he pick out? Well, a corner it is, and they know they've got to be opportunistic at this stage of the game. They get forward, but time is very much against them here. This could square the game, but no, thanks to the goalkeeper, opportunity not taken. Well, you're absolutely right, Derek. The keeper's done really well there, but really that should have been the equaliser, and there's not long left now. Targets available, cross comes in, and nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. Can they hit on the break? And he's in. Still a chance. Oh, he's missed, but by a minuscule margin. Well, he couldn't have made better contact than that. His technique is brilliant. He's so unlucky there. Domenico Berardi. Now with Jorginho. Ciro Immobile. Trying to really get at the opposition here. That's a routine take.
and the referee has decided to add on three additional minutes. There's a slide draw pass, and he might be in here. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. This could be the equaliser. Can they slot it home? Threat over for now, it seems. And it's over now. A win for Spain. It has gone according to their master plan. Stuart, what have you made of their performance? Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team and they deserve their victory.